didn't even stutter it. Yo, we put him away. Hands up, cause it's National Scissoring Day. I mean, people around the country celebrating National Scissoring Day, even, even the culinary yeah. icon, Alton Brown. Oh, yeah, I heard about that. I, listen, I've been part of many, uh, in my years, I've seen so many great National Scissor Days. This <laughs> one, I think, will be the best one I've ever witnessed, Shivani, I'm yeah, telling you. that's right. That's exactly opposite what you said on Dark last night. <laughs> okay, but I digress. Okay. Fix it in post. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we got a scissoring section. I'm glad you all are chanting that because Daddy loves to scissor. Washington, D.C., welcome to the very first annual National Scissoring Day. night unlike anything of our great sports history and it's brought to you by the acclaimed the most popular team in all of professional wrestling that's right the winningest team in AEW history that's right the best damn homegrown team in AEW history that's right and today, it was made official, thanks to every single one of you, the Scissor Me Daddy Ass t-shirt is now the number one selling t-shirt in 2022. That's right. <laughs> okay, I was gonna help him out there. He's doing pretty good but on the most own. importantly, the acclaimed your forever champs, we brought home gold, which means AEW no longer stands for All Elite Wrestling. No, AEW stands for Acclaimed Every Wednesday. We're gonna have to update the logo. They're booking themselves. <laughs> now, it's cause, it's cause for celebration and the claimed, well, we celebrate by scissoring. And trust me, I know a thing or two about scissoring. What the? They used, to, <laughs> they used to call Babe Ruth the Sultan of Swat. Well, Anthony Bowens is the Sultan of Scissor. <laughs> and there may be a few of you who are tuning in for the very first time tonight because National Scissoring Day was trending all day long. Let me break it down for you. Scissoring is a handshake. It's a, handshake. It's a sign of friendship. That's right, Taz. Come it's on. a okay, sign of a true <laughs> team. That's right. And we understand that the people want to be represented by a real team, not two dudes who were thrown together like Keith Lee and Sneaky Swerve. Sneaky Swerve would like you to believe that they deserve to be the AEW Tag Team Champions. Sneaky Swerve would like you to believe that they're the most popular thing in this industry. Well, they're wrong. Everyone loves the acclaimed. Swerve, this isn't your house. Daddy S. This is Daddy S's house. Now for everybody in the building and the millions of people at home, it's National 
Scissoring Day. With that being said, I was sent down to City Hall today and asked, yes, I'm a big deal, <laughs> if I would present you guys with this. Keys to the District of Columbia? That's awfully big key if that's the case. <laughs> that's what they used to cut the ribbon at National Scissor Day. <laughs> and the marathon. Oh, he's running with scissors. Don't do it, Bowens. <laughs> it's a huge scissors. No running with scissors in your hands, please. <laughs> oh, this is so much fun. This really is. Folks, at this point in the service, we'd like everybody to turn to your right and your left and offer a sign of peace to your neighbor via scissoring. Peace be with you, Anthony. It's like being a mess. <laughs> but different. Yeah, this is a lot more fun here. It's not denominated. This guy's having a blast. <laughs> National Scissoring Day comes to a close. Bringing the fans together. How about that? As National Scissoring Day comes to a close, I want to talk about greatness. Yeah. Guys, I want to talk about greatness. About 40 years ago, here in this city, Washington, D.C., Greatness was achieved when Washington won the Super Bowl. Yeah. Super Bowl 17. A lot of people here probably don't remember that. I wasn't even born yet, but it means a lot to me because my dad was on that championship team. That's awesome. And his Super Bowl ring is his prized possession. He wears it proudly to this day. And he achieved greatness here all those years ago, just like the acclaimed achieved greatness when we won the AW Tag Team titles. This city represents also the ugly side of America, the division in our country. But one thing we can agree on is that everyone loves the acclaimed. So put your twos up, put your scissors up right now. Because it's our duty to bring everyone together. Today there is no left and no right, no red, no blue. The acclaimed wears pink and everyone looks good in pink, baby. We are the people's choice, we are the people's voice and we're gonna make history here tonight. We're gonna do the first ever bipartisan scissor to unite this country. Let's do it.